technology and engineering with bold techniques and hindsight skills. When the concrete progresses in various dimensions, I, on behalf of School of Computer Science, Engineering and Information Systems, extend my heartfelt gratitude to each, each activity served as instrumental in the overall growth of this great institution. I extend my heartiest welcome to our esteemed chief guest, Sri S. Krishnan, Sikh of India. Sir, we thank you for accepting our invitation and gracing this occasion in spite of your busy schedule. It's indeed a great pleasure having you amidst us today. With great enthusiasm... And quite honestly, one of the reasons I accepted the invitation to attend this event is uh, uh, today, uh, of course, there's always a time. It's one among them. And they are also getting the Universal Choice Prize, all three members. Pleasure, as I already told you, to be present here this afternoon. The Ministry of uh, Electronics and Information Technology is quite focused on growing the digital economy of India. And the digital economy grows at almost, the digital economy of India grows at almost, say, 20% plus year on year. If you look at the pace at which the electronics manufacture grow in the country, if you look at the pace at which the IT and other sectors grow, the growth rate comfortably exceeds about 20 to about 20 percent. Technology revolution today could be equivalent to the industrial revolution of the 19th century, and the opportunity for growth is significant. But what matters really is having a population and having enough people and students who have the knowledge and the skills to apply to this area and that becomes critically important in, in, in a time like this. VIT is really on technology. That is the area that many of you can make a significant contribution. And given the fact that you are diverse, given the fact that you have the soft skills necessary to tackle the challenges of the world, I think you will find that you will be in a position to actually ensure that when you join the industrial workforce and when you, when you join any industry, you're able to bring the set of values that you need for modern technology to be used in a way that is truly beneficial to the world. Because, uh, uh, say, artificial intelligence is the misuse of the technology, is a way that same technology can be misused to cause harm to society, to cause harm to people. We come across many of these aspects in everyday life. Many people fear that, and many people fear technology for that reason. So the people who are technologists, the people who actually apply this technology, who are able to use it, 